what, what the lady's talking about. Yeah. Yeah. What's up, family? Imagine this. Your three-year-old child is lying in bed in the comfort of his home along with his four-year-old sister. And all of a sudden, your house is sprayed with bullets by gunmen determined to kill. This is the story of Asaya Fakuero. This kid was killed as he slept in his bed some uncivilized mutts, teenagers, pulled out guns and just started spraying the house like it was damn, you know, like a movie. You know, it looked like, what was that movie with, with uh, Eddie Murphy and, uh, what was it? Eddie Murphy, Red Fox, Harlem Nights. That scene when Arsenio Hall and uh, Eddie Murphy, you know, when they was, you know, dude was trying to kill, Arsenio Hall was trying to kill quick. <laughs> Crazy, man. Man, we ain't gonna make it like this. I can guarantee you that. Ain't no way. You're killing the babies. You know? You're killing the babies, man. We ain't gonna make it like this. Not at all. These dudes, the trip part about it is that they're selective killers. The police will come through, slap them up, put fake charges on them, kill their homies, beat up their little brother, call their mama, their girlfriend, their sister a bitch, call their grandmama a bitch. They won't do nothing. Because these motherfuckers are brainwashed. Cowards. That's right. They are cowards. Killing don't make you real. Killing don't make you a gangster. Anybody can kill. Some little five-year-old boy accidentally killed his mama the other day. Anybody can kill. That's nothing. You want to, like, you want to get real about it. I tell you, it is a time to kill. But that ain't it. Remember the uh, Samuel Jackson movie, A Time to Kill? The rednecks raped his baby. He took a shotgun, hid in the stairway of the, I think it was a stairway, like under the stairs or something like that, of the courthouse. As the killers was coming out, he put that thing on. Oh yeah. There comes a time, but that ain't it. And see, that's what these clowns don't get. They just go out and kill people over dumb shit. I mean, just take life over nothing. And then in, in, in turn, Throw their own life away. Two of these clowns have already been captured, so you know they're going to catch everybody else involved because they got to give it up. They got to, they finna give it up. They finna give it up. They finna, they are about to give it up like a sweet boy in the penitentiary. Oh, yeah. They killed... 
Michael Moultrie in Chicago shot this little boy in the head twice, four-year-old. The mother and the father pleaded with the killers to come forward. Or anybody who know anything about the killers, come forward. They got a reward out and everything for them. And the mother was pleading and saying, you know, don't make us, you know, suffer, you know. Like you already took our, you took our son, you know. Don't take away our, our, our hope. They're pleading with people with no conscience. You can't plead with them. You can't plead with bullies. You can't bargain with bullies. Bullies need to be bullied and they have to be brought to heel. See, when you do certain things, I mean, like we're, we're all guilty of not being on our best behavior, right? We're all guilty at times of bad behavior. But it's certain behavior that's indicative of evil. And I'm talking pure evil. You shoot a four-year-old kid in the head twice, that's as about as low as it can go. They shot this boy twice in the head. They're killing our babies, fam. So far, 41 children in Chicago have died this year from bullet, from gunshots, gun violence. 41 children under 17 years old gun down. 41 children. Fam. What the protest? Where's the call for real justice? Where's the call for street justice? Any kind of justice. Just go get them. See, certain things Certain type of crimes people do. I mean, you really should, we, we, we really should respect all life. But it's certain things, certain things people do, everybody just got to get on their ass. Everybody just got to come together and say, nah, fuck that, we ain't having that. We ain't doing that. Oh, hell no. That's when everybody got to come together and just get their asses. Snatch them up off, it don't matter if it's your cousin your brother, your sister, your mother, your daddy, your whatever, your best friend. Their ass has got to go because they are unfit to live amongst the civilized. Man, we ain't going to make it like this. There is no refuge for our children. Some of us got grown children. Well, guess what? Your grown children are going to have children. And while they may not be interested in kicking it and hanging and being in relationships with these kind of fools, they could be somewhere out enjoying themselves. And them fools can pull that thing out and just start shooting. Anybody can get it. They roll it up on the restaurants, robbing people while they're on the patios, and even in the upscale places. Ain't nowhere to go. There's nowhere to run. There ain't nowhere to hide. Everybody got to be strapped at all times. And I am a, that's why I am a strong gun advocate. I believe in the right to bear arms. Oh, yes. And I love it when their asses get shot. I, and I especially love it when they bleed out. Oh, yeah, man. I like when they go down. I like when they get hit and they just drop. Oh, man, I love it. I love it. You know why I love it? Because if they don't get dropped, they're going to drop somebody else. They're going to go out there and drop some innocent person. These clowns, 
are just taking these babies' lives, just killing every, just killing everything. I mean, they just they acting like they they acting like it's some kind of movie or something, fam. They just coming out, just killing everything, just shooting for no reason. They ain't got no cause. These bastards' life don't mean nothing to them. So they just wake up and just go out and just murder everybody else, just kill everybody else. I mean, how do you live a life where you just don't care about your own life? Where you don't give a damn if you're free or not? You don't care if you live or not? You don't care? Yeah. Y'all don't like that. They don't like that. They don't like that breathing shit. Uh, man, that shit feel good to me, man. I, I love it. Oxygen. Oh, man. They got a problem with it. Getting up, walking out the door, driving across the street, getting on a plane, getting on a bus, whatever, going out of town, coming back when you feel like it. Going to bed when you want to. Turning off the light when you feel like it. Keep it on if you want to. Go get you some Papa Do's. If that's how you're feeling, if you want some salada, go get you some salada or get you a, a Hank's burger or Popeye's, whatever you're feeling. You should just go get it. Y'all don't like that? You don't like that kind of freedom? Oh, you want to lay up in a damn morgue with a wire cut in your chest, your chest wide open. And they digging all in your shit, cutting up stuff, stealing organs. That's what you want. Man, let me tell you something, fam. If any of you youngsters out there got a homie that is off the chain, he a fool, that's the dude that always doing something stupid, you better get from around him. Because I'm going to tell you something. Two fools ain't going to make it. Somebody got to have some sense. You see two people in a relationship. Oh, they're doomed. Some people say, well, you know, they 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 deserve each other. Oh, yeah, man, you know, they that's a good fit. I mean, perhaps maybe they get two of them just cancel each other out. Because I ain't I'm not subscribing to trying to save somebody. I listen, no, 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 no. Go over there and let, let him save you. Holler at me when you're ready for a real solid healthy relationship, all that toxic stuff, you can go over there with that. I ain't trying to save nobody in no relationship. I ain't doing that. I ain't watching my back, looking around, worried about checking on. No, I ain't doing all that stuff, man. I'm not doing it. Go get yourself right first. Then come over here. I'm finna let you break me down, steal my joy. Fair, we got to do better, man. We're going to have to do better. We got to protect these babies. And when we fail to, we got to make up by going to get whoever violate them. We got to get them and we got to do them bad. No mercy. Fuck them. No more talk. What, what, what the haters talking about?